Yo, 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 what's good, my people? Welcome back to another video. My name is Ivanor, and today we're gonna be. <sighs> I forgot my hat. You guys know I can't forget my beautiful Santa hat. This is so amazing. Oh my god. So, what I decided we'd do today with um, today's video was rank the Spider Man movies. Now, I've seen this a lot of. We're not gonna start today, are we? We're not gonna start today. Today we're gonna be ranking the all the Spider-Man movies. Stop hitting the fucking on the tier list. So this is just my opinion. So don't get triggered. Um, I mean, without further ado, let's just get right into it. Oh my god! Since I'm poor, I'm gonna be ranking. I'm not ranking. I'm gonna be putting these for well, ranking this on a tier list on a notebook because um I'm poor and uh, yeah. But you guys will be seeing this on. On screen, you guys will see the actual tier list, which I will edit. Tier list is gonna go like this: we got the Spider-Man, the three Spider-Man movie, the Rain with Toby. I can't speak today. What is? We're gonna have the three movies with Tobey Maguire, uh, the two movies with Amazing Spider-Man, which is Andrew Garfield. I'm just gonna put Andrew Garfield, and the three movies with Tom Holland. And we already know which one's gonna be the first one up. The first one is going to be the most recently that we watched, which is, um, I forgot the name because I don't have it with me. Spider-Man No Way Home. So we're gonna be ranking that, obviously, S tier because I forgot to put that on. And I mean, it goes without being said, like why this movie is S tier because this movie has all three Spider-Men in the movie movie so i mean i think that speaks for itself plus um it's really well done emotional and has really great comedy by ned mj and everybody who was in the movie even the villains they were so funny as hell so that goes without being said the third movie which is um spider-man no way home then the second movie we have i'm going backwards or i don't even know the second movie we have is Spider-Man 1, okay? Rami, what's his name? Rami? I don't even know. Spider-Man 1, we got the first movie with Green Goblin and Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man. And this shit better not be making that noise or I'm gonna cry. But definitely, I'm gonna put that at a B. Like, I, I love the movie. I love all these movies, but I'm just gonna tell you, I... Mm, no, you know what? I'm gonna put it in an A. This movie, the first Spider-Man one, one, was pretty good. And it deserves to be at an A because of the um, story. I mean, this, the villain, Green Goblin, he's the best villain in the MCU. And we got Spider-Man 2, my favorite personally, I think. It's, it's definitely A tier. You know, put that Spider-Man 2 on the A tier because of Doc Ock. And, you know... Peter's character development and all the trauma he has to suffer through um, because MJ is a whore. And we got the Spider-Man 3. Um, Spider-Man 3, mm, gotta say, gotta say. A lot of people hate this movie, but I really don't. Uh, I'm gonna have to put that with, um, you know, all three movies are, are A tier. This movie had several great villains. It was just like a swap meet version of No Way Home. Let's be honest. Please don't send me death threats. I'm gonna hunt you down. So we got those three movies down. Now we also got The Amazing Spider-Man with Andrew Garfield. So we're gonna see how that goes. Uh, the first movie, pretty amazing. Like the title, get it? Cause I'm, uh. Oh brother, this guy stinks! Though, that, I'm gonna say that was a pretty good movie. Um, uh, uh, well, I'd probably say like a high B pl B. If I'm gonna say that high B like a B plus so now we got the second movie a lot of people shit on that movie for some reason I mean I I, I don't like the Green Goblin let's be honest Harry just uh, ha Green Goblin in that movie looked like a hairy pickle Electro which looks like electric blueberry I mean I don't know dude it, it was an enjoyable movie I love that, the CGI and everything, but I don't know, it just wasn't my taste to be honest. But I love the movie, definitely. But I just, you know, I would prefer to watch other movies in Amazing Spider-Man 2. So we're gonna put that at a C plus, okay? C. So Amazing Spider-Man 2 at a C. Homecoming, uh, 
definitely slow paced. Um, I mean, let's be honest, Iron Man carried Iron Man. <laughs> Still a great intro introduction to this new Spider-Man that we had, so I definitely give that a B. Yeah, a B. Far From Home for me was a little bit boring. I mean, all I watched was a Iron Man from the thrift store with drones fight Spider-Man. I mean, it was a good battle, let's be honest, but I mean, I just... Compared to the other movies, I mean, it was alright, okay? It was alright, so I... Did definitely enjoy the movie i wouldn't say it's a waste of time but definitely a b tier in my opinion okay don't kill me although i'm not gonna i'm gonna be honest with you far from home is much better than uh amazing spider-man 2 so uh, what the hell is this this tier list is shit yeah i think that's a pretty good tier list in my opinion in my opinion so we got no way home at the s tier and uh, we got <laughs> Spider-Man 1, Spider-Man 2, and Spider-Man 3, Homecoming, uh, A tier list, which honestly could be debatable, you know, put, put, push that up towards uh, the S tier, but you know, for time's sake, because I gotta go do something. We got Amazing Spider-Man 1 and Far From Home at the B tier list, and we got, and we got um, Amazing Spider-Man 2 at the C tier. Well, I don't think any of the um, uh, Spider-Man movies deserve to be D or F. I'm going to be honest with you and realistic. But if you disagree, it's your opinion, right? Hope you guys did enjoy this tier list. If you guys this, um, if you guys want to debate, not debate, but if you guys want to tell me your tier list, go down in the comments and type down what you think should be switched around. Because I feel like this list could be definitely switchable. So, um, you know, this is my list. Guys, uh, guys, I'm poor. Guys, I'm poor. Hope you guys did enjoy this. Uh, uh, uh. Sorry. Hope you guys do have a lovely day. And as always, guys, have a good one. Peace. <laughs>